Today, we asked what Madison County learned after a national task force tracking coronavirus visited because of a spike in cases in Huntsville. Way 31 Sophia Borelli is live outside Huntsville City Hall with what the county was told to do. Sophia. The Madison County EMA director told me that they've received three recommendations from that national task force in less than 24 hours ago, and right now they're trying to figure out how to implement them. Madison County Emergency Management Director Jeff Birdwell said the COVID-19 Response Assistance Field Team, or CRAFT, wants its data analysis experts to look at coronavirus statistics in the county. We know the things that we're tracking locally now. Uh, the first step uh, associated with that is actually to uh, meet with those folks that have expertise in that area. And we talked about asking questions, what can you provide? Those numbers are already provided to the federal government. Birdwell couldn't explain exactly what data analysts want to study. The second recommendation was about getting the correct messaging to the public, but again, no specifics were given. What particular groups uh, do we see that we need to improve in getting the message uh, as far as COVID-19? precautions out to. Finally, the task force talked about what the start of the school year looks like. One day after the recommendations, Huntsville, Madison City, and Madison County schools all announced virtual learning for the first nine weeks of school. Bringing the kids in in a certain way and, and conducting traffic, at least as far as the schools are concerned, in, in a more socially distanced way. Birdwell says right now the state and the task force are working on the next steps to figure out how they're going to implement those recommendations. Live in Huntsville, Sophia Borelli, Way 31 News.